Did you know that people with diabetes are at greater risk for heart disease? I am Dr. Amrish Mittal. I am the Chairman and Head of Endocrinology and Diabetes at the Max Healthcare System. Diabetes produces two kinds of problems in the heart. One is it promotes plaque development and narrowing of arteries. And secondly, it affects the heart muscle which doesn't pump well enough. Both these heart conditions are at least twice as common in people with diabetes than those without diabetes. It is natural therefore that we should screen for these complications periodically as advised by a doctor. For example, now there are simple blood tests and echocardiogram and other non-invasive tests that can help us decide whether our heart is getting affected by diabetes or not. We have to take several measures to protect our heart from the ravages of diabetes. It, as always, lifestyle measures are the key. Healthy diets, regular physical exercise, and certainly giving up smoking. Maintaining ideal body weight is crucial. But if we were to look at our targets, we are looking at the ABC of diabetes. A meaning A1C, which we have to control very well. That is a reflection of our blood glucose level over the last three months. So a level of over se below seven is generally considered safest. We should maintain our LDL cholesterol always below 100 and maybe even below 50 or 70 in some individual cases as directed by the doctor. And of course, blood pressure should be maintained at 130 by 80 or less. So if you maintain A1C, B for blood pressure and C for cholesterol, then you are protecting your heart to a large extent. Not only that, newer anti-diabetic medications, which are primarily developed for controlling blood glucose, actually also help in reducing cardiac risk. And therefore, ask your doctor if you are a candidate for any of these new anti-diabetic medications. So, while heart disease remains a major problem for people with diabetes, if you address it properly right from the beginning, you can save your heart. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest healthcare updates.